The next relationship type in the foreign key list is one-to-one. -one. There are three types of one-to-one -one relationships. One is where it's mandatory on both sides. One is where it's mandatory on one side and optional on the other. And the last one is when it's optional on both sides. So let's check out and see if we have any one-to-one -one relations. We do, we have a one-to-one -one here, and it is mandatory on the user side and optional on the branch side. So let's find that one, mandatory on one side. So we're gonna take the primary key on the mandatory side and add it as a foreign key on the optional side. So the mandatory side is the user. So we're gonna take the primary key of the user and add it as a foreign key in the optional side. And here we have a manager who is a user. So we'll use that user ID to identify the manager. And all we have to do, since we already have the attribute there, is we'll simply add the foreign key designation. And there we have that one-to-one -one relationship handled correctly.